Hello again, this is Sickle Yield. I will be continuing my beginner series on DAS Studio, but for now I'm going to answer a question I was asked on 3D School on DeviantArt. The question was about how to deal with elf ears or very high cheekbones and hair. Because I have Genesis 3 female here and the Layton hair from DAS 3D, when you dial in large pointy ears, you get a strange look with the hair. So I'm going to do that now. I'm going to actor head ears and fantasy sci-fi. I'm going to use my own ears from fantastical features, but any elf ears will cause this same effect if they are large enough. So I'm going to use my elf ear 04 extra long preset here, and you can see it creates an unwanted ear shape in the hair there. The fix for this is very easy. I'm going to go to the scene tab and double click on Genesis 3 female and go down here to the hair itself and left click on that. Then I'm going to go to the parameters tab. If you don't have a parameters tab, you can right click on your screen, go to add pane tab and choose it from the list and it will add one for you. For the meantime, I'm going to go to this tiny settings button up here, display options for the active pane on the parameters tab. It sort of looks like a little yellow arrow pointing to the right when it's highlighted, white when it's not highlighted with some lines that sort of look like a piece of paper. So I'm going to click on that. And there's a whole list of options here, but the important one is show hidden properties. You probably don't have this checked by default, but you should. If it's not on, turn it on right now. Now, when I go to look at the hair, I can see some things that I couldn't see before, including the currently used tab, which now shows this grayed out ear morph because the hair has picked up that ear morph from the character and projected it into the mesh of the hair. So I'm going to go to where it says 100% here, and I'm going to click on that and type 0 and press enter. And I've just turned that morph off in the hair, basically. And that's all that there is to it. You can do this with any face morph or ear morph or any other morph of Genesis 3 female that is projected into a hair, or Genesis 3 male, or Genesis 2, or any other figure that uses the same technology. That's all there is to it. Happy rendering!